Sandy Cortez wasn't even inside the Capitol on January 6th. But she and Lindsey Graham are on the same page. We know that because occasionally Sandy Cortez tells us about her lived experience on January 6th. During a recent special on CNN, Sandy Cortez, does she ever stop talking about herself, by the way? She explained she wasn't simply afraid of being murdered by Ashley Babbitt. She was also worried about being raped. There's a lot of sexualizing of that violence. And um, I didn't think that I was just going to be killed. I thought other things were going to happen to me as well. So what it sounds like what you're telling me right now is that you didn't only think that you were going to die. You thought you were going to be raped. Yeah. Yeah. I thought I was. Sexualizing? Get a therapist, honey. This is crazy. These people are mad because they thought the election wasn't fair. Now, you may disagree with that, but it wasn't about you. Surprise, surprise. Sexualizing the violence. I was going to be raped by Ashley Babbitt. Imagine some Republican lady saying that about a BLM riot as thousands of rioters descended on neighborhoods and burned businesses all over the country. Kenosha, Portland, Georgia, Green Bay, Wisconsin. What would happen if some Karen said that? It was sexualized violence. <laughs> can you imagine? Probably go to jail for that. But Sandy Cortez can say it because the people rioting on January 6th had the wrong political views.